be showing how to do uh, I'm on PlayStation 4 I'm gonna get straight to it how to do vending machine how to uh, set it up and uh, you know how to uh, how to sell stuff in here so I got a few things selling right now I got three of those guys right now and I got a second vending machine I got a few things over here selling so I just made it I'm gonna show uh, the kind of base that I just made real quick I just made like a window that's all I did. I did a window. I made like a little two by one over there. Okay, I was like, is that a guy? I right, made like a little little four door here. Uh, and TC. There's nothing in the boxes, but yeah. So yeah, a little two by one. Put a bunch of doors on, and then next door I just threw a, a one by one. So. All right, so let me show you how to do this. All right, so I'm set up here. I just named it random stuff. I'll show you how to name that, and then there's my other one. So go into so if you press triangle. Go into here. You can uh, press. Uh, wait, oh, wait, wait, wait. All right, hold on. Hold square. Go into uh, open. Okay, open. If you go into open, you can rename it at the bottom there. It says uh, rename. So I could rename it to something else, see? So, yeah, you can re you can name your vending machine. There's not many tutorials on the console how to do this. So I figured, oh, I got a PlayStation, so let's make it. So, all right, so here, there's the stuff I'm selling, whatever. So in order to do this, all right, so you can press triangle, go straight into here. So I'm selling these. Right here is what you're selling on top here. So you can see I got hazmat suits. There's three of them. You notice there's not three at the top. You just put them in the down part. So I'm going to add a fourth one to here. Another hazmat. So you see I'm only selling three. So if I press square, go into here. There's three that I'm selling. And it shows up on top what is in there to sell. What has, you know. Alright, so let's say I want to add another one. So I got them selling for... Uh, so the cost item is what someone has to bring to buy that hazmat. So they need 150 sulfur ore to buy that hazmat suit. So I have three in there right now. I'm gonna add another one. Hold on. So, so you see it. You see it says three. So all you have to do is just add a, another one, and then it won't show up. So it still says three. So what you have to do is go to administration, press triangle, turn your broadcasting off, you see at the bottom there, now it's off. All right, press triangle again to turn it back on, and it will take a few seconds for it to come up, and see, now I'm selling four. So I got four left now. All right, so that's how you sell and buy stuff. There's not really a quick tutorial on how to do this, so I'm just trying to make it, you know, the simplest, quickest thing. So it does take a second. Even when you rename your, uh, your vending machine, it takes a while for it to uh, load in and you know for it to rename itself so even like when I sell stuff so here I'm gonna sell a uh, all right I got room over here so what if I want to sell something so yeah I would come over here I go to administration so I press triangle all right let's say I want to sell these guys I don't need salvage so I want to sell salvage hammer so and I want to sell it for I don't know man I usually so if you press R2 and or L2 and R2 yeah it'll cycle through what you want to uh, trade for that salvage so you can choose anything in here so I'm selling the salvage it says right there sales item down there and then whatever I want to cost item that's who has to bring me like they'd have to bring me a rock so let's uh I'll do a uh, what do I want? What do I need? I'm, I'm gonna put a. You know what? I'm gonna put a. I'm gonna, so you have to press L1 and R1, and you see the numbers moving down there. That is what you're gonna use to uh, determine on how much ore I'm gonna get, like metal ore. So let's say I want like 112 metal ore. I would just hold R R1. I wish there was a simpler way, like you could type in the number, but that is the simplest way to do it. And R1 is going to be how you determine on how much ore you're going to get. So I want metal ore, so I'd go to metal ore, and I'd put... I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be cheap. You know what? I'm going to be cheap. We're going to be a cheap man. Yeah. 
So 50, I want 50. All right, so I put it in. All right, so I'm buying 50. All right, I that did not go into the back there. So if you look on here, it's gonna, oh, oh. And then every time you do something, you have to turn your broadcasting off, like every time for it to update. You turn it off, then turn it back on everything you do. All right, so where is it? It's not in there yet. Is it not in there? It's not in there yet. All right. So I think if you add it, I'm still trying to figure this out a little bit. So if I add it, so you add it to the back here and it goes into there. So I'm putting three in there right now. Actually, I got four. So I'm putting four in there right now. Okay, I thought someone was outside. All right, so it's still in there. So if I turn it off, and I turn it back on. Now it should be in there. Okay, yeah, see, salvage hammers. I got four left in there. So that's how you do that. That's that's literally all you have to do. Yeah, every time you have to shut your broadcasting off and turn it back on. Every time you put something in there. Every time you rename your place. Every time you uh, do, like, anything, dude. Yeah, you have to re you have to shut the broadcasting off and turn it back on. That's that's how you do that. Um, what else do I not need? So let's do another one. I don't need this. Here, so add this. All you have to do is press X on whatever you want to. So if I press X on this salvage sword, I want, and then you go through the cycle of stuff here, what you want for that salvage sword, per se, if that's what you're selling. So let's say I, I have a salvage sword. I want... <sighs> No one's gonna give me tech trash. Are you kidding me? Like, tech trash. This guy wants a tech trash for salvage. You never know though. Someone might. Someone might. You never know. You can get gear. You can get. I could trade a salvage for a salvage or something. I think. Yeah. Where? There it is. I could trade a salvage. Of, so if you you could probably scam someone. You could probably sell like a broken pickaxe like that in my inventory. And then trade it for another pickaxe, unless that other guy had trades you for a broken or even worse pickaxe. I don't know, man. <laughs> Just saying. Now you can trade ammo, dude. I mean, you can you can trade some stuff. I think someone's outside. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna set it up. Uh. You can even get a supply signal, dude. If someone's really willing to give you a supply signal, you could, yeah, you could do a supply signal. Um, let's let's do, uh, yeah, let's do more metal ore. And you know what? We're we're not gonna do anything great. We're gonna do, uh, let's do, uh, you know, what? metal ore is easy to find. We'll do a hundred. You get six hundred from each one, so we'll do a hundred. I only have one sword, so you put it in there. And then you could keep it like that. And if you ever come across another salvage sword, you can just come in here, throw it in the back, and yeah, bam, bam, bam. So I'm gonna turn it off right now because I'm gonna have to turn it on and off anyways. All right. So if I put this in here, in the back, turn it back on. Now it should be in there. Salvage sword, hundred metal. There we go. All right. So. And these, these have a lot of storage, so if you can put these in your house, too... Dude, you, you get it, you, you can, yeah, yeah, they, they got a lot of storage. I think they got as much as a... I think they got one more row, I think. One or two more rows than the, uh... Actually, maybe just one more. One more row than the, uh, large boxes, so... We're gonna do some train running, but yeah, that's... That's, uh... I'm still kinda learning. But yeah, when something sells too, so when something sells, like one of your things sell back here, it'll be gone. And then it'll be replaced for whatever you uh, wanted for that. So let's say, so I'm selling these for, I think it was like 150 sulfur something. So when, when something sells too, you can look on your map and then see, you know, oh, hey, I had four hazmats in there. Now I only have, you know, two, so. So let's say someone wanted two hazmats. So now two hazmats will be gone and in their place will be uh, 300 sulfur. So that's how that works. You just come in here in the bag. Um, but yeah, um, that's how you use the vending machine. There's not very many tutorials on uh, 
vending machines on console and then the ones that I watched weren't very you know great I guess but yeah if you have any comments on it let me know um just comment at the bottom I'll respond as soon as I can um and yeah so yeah it was it, it was 20 gears to make these and like some metal so I think high qual no how many gears no it's 20 high qual and then like five gears I don't know I, it was easy to find online so yeah we're gonna go do some train running when it comes brighter outside but yeah I don't I, I got a little setup here it's not nothing crazy man it's just like a little it's just a little dude it's not crazy crazy in here all right Go out this way. It's starting to become brighter out, so we'll go do train now. So that's how you do uh, vending machines. They got a lot of health. They got like 1,250 health. It took like three C4s to break it. You cannot pick the. You cannot pick them back up either. Once you deploy them and put them on the ground, you the only thing you can do is rotate them. You cannot get your hammer and put them back <laughs> into your inventory. That is one thing I learned. I was like, what the fuck, dude? So I literally had to make three sat three uh, C4s come back and destroy it. It took three C4s. Yeah, I was using like a salvage axe, stuff like that to break it. Dude, it was taking way too much time. I was like, I don't have time for this, dude. <laughs> it was, yeah, when I say it was taking too much time, dude, it, it was taking way too much time. All right, so usually there's a box here. Oh, garage door. That's big, big, big. Yeah. So yeah, garage door there. That's, that is actually really lucky. <laughs> that's like a one out of a hundred chance or something. First aid kit. I use those for uh, large oil. Large oil and small oil. Those are good. Uh, oh man, nobody even looted the inside door. Big, big, big. Got some flares. Throw at someone's head. They get too close. I wonder if those do damage. Throw those at someone's head. I wonder if they do damage. Who is Big Booty Jude? I don't even know who that is, dude. But yeah, if you uh, if you uh, do that, yeah, because vending machines, dude. I didn't. There's no freaking tutorial on them, man. I was like, what is going on here? There's no tutorial. I was mad. I was very mad. Dude, I'm, I'm getting pretty lucky here. I got a SAR. Dude, the SAR? Are you kidding me right now? I got a SAR garage door off the rip, man? Like, so all this stuff that I'm collecting too, I can go sell. <laughs> like, easy. And then uh, I found a site online, I just typed in like vending machine prices and there was a site that had like 20 freaking ads on it, but it did have prices and I was looking around at other people's bases and they were pretty much selling everything for about the same price as what was on the, uh, the website I was looking on. This website has like 10 freaking ads on it, dude, but I mean, they're not, they're not like watchable ads, you don't, you're not forced to watch them or nothing, but yeah. So how I run train yard though, is it this, this is how I run it. I run it like, I start from the left, work my way to the right, I usually come over here, I recycle whatever, some stuff, uh, and then I usually run launch like literally right after. Uh, man, we are, we are, this is looking good. And then while I'm in here though, I look at this, make sure there's, so it's turned on, oh no, it's turned off. So it is turned off, so I look at that to make sure no one has a, uh, no one's running this right now. Just just to make sure no one's running it. So yeah, but I come in here, I do all that looting, come in here, I start from over there and do it six, six tech trash, dude, what's going on? I don't really need garage doors. I think I'll keep it because I can sell it though. I don't I actually just need these. I got a lot of pipes. So yeah, I normally just come over here, get rid of a bunch of my stuff that I got, split these. And then I normally, so you need a hazmat suit to do this. So what I do is, got my hazmat suit on, run over here, and then I, uh, 
go up here. Why that's run into it? I just yeah. Like I don't care, man. And then I do some more looting. Look at that, man. I got some pretty good crates. Then we come up here. Go all the way, all the way, all the way. And then there's another one. So yeah, you need do need a hazmat suit to come up here, but look at that, 70 scrap. Dude, that's that's pretty good. I'll take the bandage. I'll use it right now. Alright, I think I hope that shouldn't have come in. Please be Chinook. Don't be a tech chopper. Uh, yeah, that sounds like Chinook. I think we're good. I think we're good, man. Don't worry about it. Get out of here! One thing my brother-in-law told me was, uh, yeah, and then I just come back here, grab my loot. Usually there's someone waiting right here, maybe? <laughs> I've had someone wait there with a DB and just blow me away one time after coming back from my loot. So watch out for that corner back there. <laughs> so yeah, to run train yard, come up here. That's what I do. I run all that. Oh, small loot. It's not really small loot either. I mean, I got a garage door. Got a, which is big. Got a SAR, which is pretty big. I got a bunch of tech trash, which is pretty good. Like six tech trash, dude. That's like, that's actually really good. Uh, there's a better tutorial than what I'm about to show you though. I mean mine, mine's pretty good but you know the way I run and stuff but there, I'm sure there's better ones out there. But yeah that, that tech trash that was pretty good. Six tech trash dude that's like 120 uh, scrap right there. And then there's usually another crate up here. It could be an army crate or it could be a uh, a, uh, a normal one. And we get one of these guys. Alright, so we get that, and then so right here, so you're going to come up to, for me, I don't know if it changes every time, but last step up here, last stairs, just go to the right, it's right there. Then you turn it on, again, if it is turned, uh, if it is already turned on, that means someone's running it, like right now. So you could, either you could get the jump on them, go over there with your little saw or whatever, take them out, or you could just run away. That's up to you, man. Um, sometimes I also, so I won't run it like how I just did, but I don't know. I like to, I like, I like running it how I just did actually, but sometimes I'll flip on, uh, I'll flip on that switch there, then run over to that, flip on that switch, and then I run to the, uh, to the last part. So it all depends on what you want to do, man. You could do this one first, then that one second, or you can do that one first and then this one second. So we're gonna do that one first and this one second. Where am I going? So you run back over here, you flip this switch, and then uh which would probably be better if I did that one first and that one second, the tower second. Cause then I would be closer to that. Yeah, I think I'm gonna start doing that actually. <laughs> I think that's what I'm gonna start doing. Alright, so come over here. I don't do green card. There's a green card and a blue card, but the green card, dude, it has one box in it, and it's either a fucking, it's either a army crate or it's a uh, a different crate. So make sure you turn this on after putting in the fuse, and then green card. So yeah, it either it only has one box in it. I stopped going in green. The green's there if you want to do green. It's connected to the same fuse. But I normally just do blue, which is right here. Right above green. So, yeah. And there's like, you could get like nine army crates, I think. There's a chance of getting nine. Which I got in what? One, two, I think three, four, five. Yeah. So, I mean, that's pretty good, dude, for blue cards. Uh, running out of room. I guess I'm tossing this out. Uh, this out. Yeah. I don't know. The mace is just as value as a hatchet. I don't know. <laughs> oh, and then don't forget your red card. You can get a red card from out of here too. So make sure you grab your red card. Swap these out. Oh, not that. Get out of here. 
you get your red card so yeah you're gonna have crates over in that corner you're gonna have crates here make sure you get the ones on the top here there are ones that hide up on the top and then grab your red card and you're good but you can't really see yeah, and you can't jump over this so it's like all right man whatever <laughs> but yeah that's how I do that's how I do train so when you're done I'll loot it up get out of here and look man I got two what was that like freaking 12 army crates or whatever Two of those little freaking good crates dude from running around just right here and then running you know into the blue card spot that's pretty good dude I mean what I got garage door I got two of these big old stone gates like that is that's pretty good man that is pretty good so yeah that's how you do vending machine that's how I run train yard I'm actually probably gonna switch it up I'm probably gonna start running the uh, the recycler I'm gonna turn that on right when I leave after the stuff's recycled and then uh yeah but you can recycle there again if you want I normally don't since I'm so close to bandit camp I just run whatever I got back home or I just sell it in my vending machine because yeah if you're, you're yeah if you're getting loot like that dude you need a vending machine man and then I do have a box that I look at all the weed look at all that yeah all right so I do have a box in here that I uh I just put like uh stuff in that I want to sell in my vending machine so you could do that too you could have a box where you just sell stuff from your vending so this is it and this is another box that I need to start selling stuff added to the vending machine so yeah I'll put the garage door in there like whatever I want to sell in the vending machine oh, I could have dropped that so yeah, I'm gonna sell these for sure in the vending machine. Uh, that's probably it actually. And the rest of the stuff, whatever you want to keep, put it in your, you know, your main part of your base or whatever. Or just put it whatever, man. Don't matter. It's your base, dude. Look at this. Look at this fool. Look at this fool. Wake up, man. Got work to do. But yeah, see, I. Wall. Got a little bit of this, a little bit of that. I got freaking components. Throw the components in here. Got a lot of tech trash. Probably should go get rid of those. Got some labs, uh, pipes. That's why I was like, I got enough pipes. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I, I, I'm gonna just not even, yeah. Those. Oh, that red card just not good. Man. Try to keep my base organized best I can too. A happy base is a happy life. Got a little bit of metal. Uh, some more gunpowder. What else do we got here? All right, so this blue card. Blue card I'd normally get from a satellite, and then green card I don't. It don't. <laughs> I just go wherever for green card. There's like four different places. You can go to the market. You can go to anywhere, dude. <laughs> sell this actually in the uh, vending machine maybe I don't know or I'll scrap it I'll probably end up scrapping it yeah some of that stuff in there will probably be scrapped too so uh, I got no room in there do I no that is that is pretty full all right uh all right we're gonna go run launch I'm just I'm just organizing I'm just setting my stuff up and look I didn't even run over there with the weapon so I don't know. I'm on a low populated uh, uh, server right now. There's only like 12 or 13 people online, so it's kind of chilling right now. Everybody's kind of just laid back chilling. I think I'm running out of space for guns too. I I, I sold some Thompsons. So I sold some customs in there for a uh, hundred and fifty, uh, which is really low for a hundred and fifty. Uh, Dude, I am out of space. <laughs> For 150 sulfur, dude, they sold fast. When I say fast, they sold fast. Yeah, I was like, ooh. I was like, dude, what the? 
Or no, it was a hundred soul for each because I got 500 back. Yeah, I sold five customs for five, for a hundred soul. I was like, hey. <laughs> but yeah, it looks like I'm going to have to sell some more stuff out of here. And yeah, this, this is it's getting a little full. It's getting a little full in here. Alright, uh... I think that's it for that. We're gonna throw this up here. Uh, Alright, so... Yeah, just stuff I wanna scrap or sell. Yeah, I'm just throwing it in here. Kinda the scrappy, silly pile. Oh, I need some med syringes. I need more than two. Two might be fine. Actually, I've done it with two. I normally bring uh, two med syringes. I, well, I normally bring four, but I should be okay with two. And, uh, yeah. I'll be okay with two. So yeah, I'm gonna bring two med syringes. I'm gonna put my wood. I put my wood in the front door. The front is to the door. The front is to the outside, so I can uh just get rid of you know throw it in a furnace out here. So I do got a lot of weed out here, so I'll just uh I need some bandages. Grab some of these guys. It's my life right now. <laughs> uh, we'll just make a bunch of bandages. Why not? So I got a bunch of bandages going on. Um, so yeah, I showed you guys how to do vending machine. This is kind of like a tutorial live stream, kind of whatever. Crazy, crazy. Yeah, the first thing I had trouble with is finding a vending machine to like tutorial. So that's why I started out with that. I'm like, let's start out with the tutorial on vending machine. nothing on how to uh how to do it on console like literally nothing <laughs> like it's pc there's you know everything but yeah so we'll go run launch now show you how i kind of run launch i've never i looked up one video on how to run launch and then that was it uh oh what is that it better not be a freaking tech chopper this guy got raided, dude. This, I woke up this morning, got on for a minute. Dude, I, I ran launch earlier. I was like, dude, what the? <laughs> this guy raided. Oh, someone built up there. What is going on? Wait, hold on. Let me see his door. Yeah, it's slowly decayed. I don't know why that door is decaying and that other one's not, but whatever. I think this is his shop too. He's got a shop set up over here. I'm like, what the heck's going on over here, man? This guy's competing with me, man. He's selling customs for like 300 uh, sulfur. I sold mine for 100, dude. They sold fast. Like, yeah, that's how you do it, man. <laughs> Don't be a cheapskate, come on. <laughs> uh, I don't need this. I'll just throw this in my inventory. So you can come to satellite and literally... What I've noticed is blue card... Is, is really easy to get and it's like boom boom right there. So yeah, I'll uh... I guess I'll show you how to do satellite too. <laughs> I'm already by it. I know exactly where the thing is, it's kinda on the way so... So yeah, to do blue card, rad satellite, I don't know, if there's probably a tutorial on this, but yeah, here's the door that you need to open, you need a green card, and then literally, the thing is right here, so to turn it on, right there, so you turn that on, come in here, you put your fuse in, you run out, or you put your fuse, I normally put the fuse in, then I turn it on, and then, uh, and all you have to do is run right here, and then there you go, <laughs> there's, your, there's your blue card. Get a blue card from there. I'm like, I might as well show you since it's on the way to 
to launch, so whatever, man. Uh, launch it over the hill. So, yeah. What's going on, man? <laughs> I don't know what you're saying, man. But I like your, uh, I like the comment anyways. I don't know what you're saying, but I like it, man. <laughs> Dude. So yeah, that's, that's how you do blue card. What else, man? So yeah, we'll go do launch. Uh, Dude, last time I was over here at launch, somebody had blew up the tank, Bradley. They, they, uh, they didn't loot him. They did well, they looted him. They didn't destroy the tank, though. I destroyed the tank. I had a pickaxe on me already. So I got, like, I got, like, 60 high qual metal and, like, some small metal and some low grade and some charcoal. I was like, what is going on? Maybe not low grade, but charcoal. But, yeah, I normally, so, big building. I just run around the whole big building. Do the, uh, <laughs> what's up, man? How you pronounce that name? What is that? <laughs> but I normally run around the big old building, go all the way to the back. Uh, go all the way around so I can avoid Bradley. I don't like that man, man. He messed you up, man. One time I tried to go against him. Don't, don't mess me up, man. And then I normally go in here, see if anybody's here kind of thing. GNS. Hey, GNS, what's going on, man? Welcome to the stream. <laughs> uh, nothing in there. So, yeah, if you come in here, you can kind of see if someone's looted anything. If they've looted, then, well, they probably took, uh, took launch, the stuff on top. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Oh, sweet mama. Go away, man. How do you get up here? <laughs> Go away, man! Hey, yeah, I'm nerdy. <laughs> I'm the nerdiest nerd on here, man. Don't worry about it. Oh, man. Go away, Tink. Go away, man. Alright. That spot usually works. Go away, man. Alright. Come back over here. Alright, green cards. In the corner. Over here. Goddamn tank. Jump up here. Go up the little stairs. Come over here. Do all this good. Good stuff over here. And then, uh... What the hell, man? Uh, you grabbed the green, the green garden. Again, if this is already turned on, someone's been in here. So put the fuse in. That's all you gotta do. Turn it on. And that's all you gotta do right there. You run all the way around. Keep going, keep going. And normally what I do is I just run back around the whole building. If you can make it across there, don't do it. Save you time. I'm gonna try it. I'm trying it. Usually the tank gets angry. I'm doing it. Got no patience, man. That would be the fastest way, what I just did. <laughs> just run across right there. The tank's not around. Perfect. Go for it, man. Alright, so run in here. Go up here. And then, uh... Uh, usually there's crates in here, but there's no crates. Again, put the fuse in. And then turn this on. Again, if it's already on, that's how you know someone is in there messing around, being a goofy. Uh... Get your red card out. You need a green and red card. Make sure you have green and red. You're not getting in here, man. Or you come over here. Better make sure, man, you got the green and red. Alright, so you are gonna get radiation poisoning. 
I normally just do bandages for right now. People do water jugs. I don't know about water jugs, man. I, I'm, I'm a little better than that. And then, yeah, the ladders, if you're on the side of them, you can just, like, make your way over. Uh, poopy time? <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, so you can make your way around them. You can maneuver a little bit. This box is here. That's freaking awesome. Because all you have to do is that. Love that box. Just jump on over. Jump on in ye. Do a little bit of do a little bit of healing. You don't have to do anything there. You don't have to jump or nothing. It's just straight straight down. And I normally crouch a little bit. Go across here. Don't jump at all. Don't do anything. Just walk forward. That's all you gotta do, man. And you just go this way. Yeah, no problem, man. Hey, thanks for joining the stream, man. Appreciate the support, brother. Really do. Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Say thanks, man. No, I'm thanking you, man. You don't thank me. I thank you, man. Yeah. Uh, and you just go to the right and then go up to the stairs. Go to the very top. You know, rest is kind of history, man. You just go right to the top. Eventually, you'll get there. God damn. Um, there's usually a box here, right when you get up to the left. Get you a nice barbed wire uh, spiky guy. Get some military crates. Alright, we got the C4, dude. Dude, the C4, man. That's the best thing you could probably get out of here. Got a gun. That's why I don't bring a gun. You usually get a gun. Dude, two full battles. Dude. Metal chest plates. Two metal chest plates. Are you kidding me, dude? That is a. Uh, it's pretty good, man. That's pretty good loot. The fuck is a C4, man? Dude. There's usually a box that spawns right here. It's not there. <laughs> it's not there. It's usually a box. I don't know. That's about it, man. Dude, the C4 for the win, man? Dude. That's pretty big. That is big. I've ran this like eight times. That's the first time I got the C4, man. So I just go out the way I came, which is this way, and then, see I only brought some cloth, some bandages, and then uh, some medical syringes. So about floor three, and then I use probably both the medical, yeah I'm going to use both the medical syringes, but floor three is where the hole's at. So I don't need these here, I can put that there. Now I got a gun. And I have enough guns at home, that's why I don't really bring one. I'm like, nah, I don't know, man. I, or I should be bringing guns if I got a lot, but I don't know. So floor 3, you're going to want to jump at floor 3. Level 3. Don't forget that, because that will wreck you. That will absolutely make you pee pee. <laughs> that will make you, yeah. And then floor 1, there's another one, so you're going to want to jump again. That one won't do as much damage, but... It still does damage. You gotta make sure this creeper's not out here. Alright. And then, yeah, the medical syringes also lower your, uh... They, uh, they lower your, uh... Radiation. I thought someone was over there. I'm freaking out, man. I got, like, some PTSD going on, man. And then, yeah, I bring a... Sometimes I bring a large one. So when my radiation is off, then I pop that. Because if I use it right now, it's not gonna do anything. Like, it'll heal me, but it won't continue to heal me, you know? So yeah, and then I got bandages, and I brought some cloth to make more bandages. So I'm gonna make a few more, and those will go straight into the inventory. And yeah. Uh... What the fuck? <laughs> what do you mean, man? You know what I'm talking about, man. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> don't act like you don't know, man. Come on, Mr. White. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> this guy. I like this guy. He's funny, man. Oh, I do need some food. You know what? I'm gonna get some food. I probably shouldn't be messing around. Since I do have a have a C4 on me. <laughs> C4. 
Fuck you, Mr. White. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, man. Oh, and I normally... Oh, I didn't... Oh, I, oh, I did get a... That's, usually I get another uh, thing from there. So I normally run blue. Usually I get another fuse from there. So yeah, I'll run blue. Let's see if that works. Alright, so it does stay on. So yeah, when I'm running past satellite here... I'm like, you know what? I already got some stuff. Let's get some more stuff. I just come in here, get some more stuff. Look at that, dude. And then, uh... Grab another blue card. Run that, run the, uh, the launch. And yeah. Or the, not launch, I mean the train yard. And then, yeah, green cards are easy to get, man, so... Not really worry about green cards. They're like the simplest cards to get. They're only like 20 scrap and uh, bandit camp. So, I mean, if you really don't want a green card and you're really, really lazy, don't want to run the lighthouse, do it. Just, just, just break like five barrels, and then you'll have like 20 scrap. That's all that is. So, yeah, I was like, do that's it, 20 scrap. What the heck is this game? Yeah, got the C4, man. Yeah, that is like one of the best things you can get there. C4, AK, uh, metal plates, metal like face mask, stuff like that. Metal like full metal outfit or whatever. I don't know what's going on over there. I'm not really worried about that base. I think it's decaying right now. Someone who raided it. There's no. There's no like a. Uh, building there's no TC down so I, I don't I don't know what happened to that base I'm not really freaking out about that base I'm just kind of leaving it alone man just leaving it alone dude I don't know what's going on it's not my problem uh oh you're Russian I should have do that looked like I almost said Russian man yeah, I know, I know a little bit of Russian, man. I know how to say, uh, abbreviate. <laughs> abbreviate. <laughs> abbreviate, uh, uh, suka, <laughs> suka abbreviate, uh, and, uh, that's about it, man. <laughs> that's all I know how to say in Russian. <laughs> Got some more weed out here. <laughs> I'm just throwing it down. I know how to say hello and and bitch in uh, in Russian. <laughs> That's it, man. <laughs> That's all I need to know, right? <laughs> Visit Russia one day, dude. That's all I need to know how to survive in Russia, man. <laughs> Probably need to know a lot more, <laughs> dude. Uh Walt with what the fuck what is that? Wilters, who the fuck <laughs> Little, what? What do you? What? What is that? What is that, man? I'm gonna put man, Wilter Walters. Who's Wilter Walters, man? Who is that? Wilter, Wilter, what? what are you trying to communicate to me, man? We got the muzzle. Got the muzzle boost. They were throwing that on. Should have threw that on while I was running around. Yeah, not too bad, man. Not too bad. Look, we still got our green card. We got a blue card now. Got a new fuse. Got some more components. Got the armor double door, man. Dude. I might just go... I might put that double door down somewhere. I 
might just put that double door down somewhere. I don't know, man. I'll put it in here for now. I might just sell it, maybe. I don't know. Figure something out to do with it. With the metal chest plates. I got too many metal chest plates. I think I got like freaking three down here, man. I got more than that, actually. Uh, yeah, we'll take the road sign jackets out. Put the metal chest plates in. Jesus, man. Imagine, imagine this guy coming in your base, man. <laughs> the Chad. The Chad, man. The Chad, man. <laughs> Dude. Jesse Pinkman in Russian? Jesse Ping Penguin? <laughs> Pigwin? What is what? <laughs> Jesse Pigwin in Russia. <laughs> Jesse Pigman in Russian. Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> what is that, dude? What is that? <laughs> no, I'm just I'm spoon kid, man. I don't know what you're talking about, man. Here's all this gear. I gotta put this gear away. Uh, can you wear this with that? I thought you could. Oh, you can't. Oh, it comes all the way down. Alright, well, I learned something new every day, I guess. Oh, that's interesting. I thought you could put those on together, but I guess not. Alright, one can go in here. Where'd I get this? What is this? Pigman. <laughs> Jesse Pigman. Dude, why do you keep saying Jesse Pigman? <laughs> I like the other guy just watching. He's just chilling. Like, it's just pretty entertaining. <laughs> ah, this gives me something to do. It's Russian weirdo with Jesse. What the fuck, man? I gotta sell some stuff. Look at all this crap. Where'd I get this from? Was that in one of the boxes? Oh my god. Uh... I don't know. I gotta, I gotta get rid of some stuff, man. Someone needs to raid me. <laughs> maybe, maybe not raid me, but... Someone needs to, needs to come by and... Hey, you got any free loot in there? <laughs> Dude, if a guy came by and asked me for free loot, do it, I'd be like, Yeah, here you go, man. <laughs> here you go. Got no, got no, got no room for all this. All right, man. Probably gonna end the stream here. I just wanted to do a quick, you know, summary on how to freaking uh, do train yard, do uh, do the uh, launch, do the uh, do all that, you know. Do the train yard, do the launch. Do a vending machine, how to freaking uh, get the vending machine going on uh, I'm on PS4 again, so yeah. I'm like, dude, nobody, nobody's doing, nobody, there's no video on the vending machine. What are you, what is going on? Uh, what? So I definitely wanted to cover the vending machine. I think I covered it as well as I can, but if not, please leave me a comment and I'll get back to you about it. Uh, but yeah, uh, dude, Jesse Wingman is out. <laughs> Walter White in Russia, Jesse P. Walter White's in Russia, man. What do you want? I'm out of here, man. Hey, thank you for joining the stream, man. Keeping me entertained. Hope that entertained you, man. Keeping me some company. Hope I kept you some company, man. I appreciate it. Uh, alright man, well you have a great day man.